Virgo, my earth baby's positive vibes. Motivation, inspiration, love, light, positive energy, goodwill, and healing all oh, your way. <clears throat> I am the greatest healer of all time with the message, bad health is big business, and I'm here to put them out of business. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. This page has been a blessing to you. Thank you for your donations, your love, your grace. Please visit GOAT.world, where every physical ailment meets a physical healing. At GOAT.world, please visit GOAT.world, where every, uh, <laughs> every physical ailment meets a physical healing. Head swelling, PTSD, stroke, anxiety, depression, Alzheimer's, uh, fibromyalgia, sprain, strains, migraines are at an all-time high, all at the age of all-time low. At GOAT.world, our energy techniques reverses your traumas at the site. No longer will you need drugs, pills, or surgeries. We reverse your traumas at the site with our most effective non-invasive techniques. So please visit GOAT.world. If you feel better, you think better, and your reality will become better. If we are what we eat, if we cheat, we must treat. So eat right, treat right. I need you guys on the massage bed twice a month. Open up that lymph system. Let's get the junk out. Decompress that nervous system so we're not walking around like big balls of tension and emotion. Pardon. Please stay away from pork. Please stay away from shellfish. There's no way we can manifest a healthy body with a filthy diet. Please stop cutting your hair. Your beard is the outer representation of your nervous system. If we were to go into our body and cut our nervous system, swelling, fibromyalgia, disease would produce. So as we short circuit our system on a nightly, weekly, monthly basis, where the head goes, the body shall follow. Head swelling, PTSD, stroke, anxiety, depression, so many more. I urge you to find a balance of mind, body, and spirit that is unique to you for life's a marathon, not a sprint. Please find your the fine balance of mind, body, and spirit as far as the proper sleep, diet, water intake, workout life, physical therapy life, massage therapy life, meditation, prayer, getting out in the elements, whatever your balance of mind, body, and spirit is, I hope that you find it because we're here for the long haul. But what does it benefit you to have your heart's desires and cannot enjoy it due to poor health? The name of the game is obedience over sacrifice. Nothing changes until you do. Learn the universal laws so you know how to play this game and win. And if you want to find your purpose, fall in love with your service. All right, Virgo, you got ready for your word of the day. Eyes roll back, taking all the positive energies of the universe into your stomach. Exhale all those negative thoughts, baby. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. This page has been a blessing to you. Thank you for your donations, your love, your grace. Please visit GOAT.world, where every physical ailment meets a physical healing. Virgo, your word of the day. And this is pretty much in your lane and your perspective because you guys don't give yourself enough self-love and your frequency. You're doing so much. You always do so much. You're so logical, so smart, so hardworking. You all you bury your head down, you grit your teeth, and you guys make do, make sure that you get things done. I want to commend you, but once again, guys, it, before you go outside your door and before you come back into your house, make sure that you have a full cup for yourself, something that you can at least save for yourself if you fill others' cups that are around you, because you are a helper. When, um, when you un unconditionally love, you will sacrifice yourself for the betterment of those, and that's what you're not here for. Self-love, you're here to make sure that you have the best experience, human and spiritual experience down here while you help those along the way, but you have the best experience. Obedience over sacrifice. Anyone can sacrifice for the, for the next person and find it in their soul and why they've done it, but being obedient to the universal law that your spirit is under, the jurisdiction that you're under is way more uh, lucrative and way more beneficial than sacrificing for the next person and then they can say in some type of way of poetry that you're valiant and thankful for that. No. Obedient. Be obedient to what your spirit is, what feeds your spirit, what's created your spirit, what lights your spirit on fire. I attend to my needs by listening to my heart. Listen to your heart. My inner essence lets me know what is good for me, what is not good for you. If you don't like it, know that you're not missing out. If it doesn't feel good, it's not for you. It's maybe for someone else, but you're not missing out. I respect my limits. You're not missing out. I answer my the requests of my body and my soul. If there's some place that you don't even like going, but you'd make it tolerable, we're not any lo no longer tolerating any place, form, thing, food, or habit. We're no longer tolerating either is in line with what our frequency is 
or just letting it go. Thus, I learned to love myself. Learn to love yourself, guys. More self-love. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. This page has been a blessing to you. Thank you for your donations. Thank you for your love, your grace, and please visit GOAT.world where every physical ailment meets a physical healing, guys.